largest city of the world, the exotic Davao. My name is Lia Andrea Aquino Ramos. Candidate number 17 is 25-year-old Lia Andrea Ramos. Lia is all of 5 feet 7 and 1 fourth inches and 113 pounds with vital statistics of 34 and a half, 23 and a half, 35. We will have the decision of our board of judges on the swimsuit competition. But before that, however, we would like to present one of the special awards of Binibini Pilipinas. And that's the award for Miss Photogenic. Now, the winner of this award earned the highest score in the beauty of face category at the pre-judging of our board of judges. She will get 20,000 pesos worth of wardrobe from Cumbia at Gateway Mall, 20,000 pesos in cash from our photo sponsor, Picture City, plus a Canon PowerShot A410 digital camera. How about that? All right, and the winner, as tabulated by our auditors, is right here from Sisip Cores and Vilayo. Mr. Lito Montes. Yes, sir. Good to see you again. Miss Photogenic on Binibini Pilipinas 2006 is none other than. Candidate number 17, Lia Andrea Ramos. Presenting the award to Miss Photogenic, Lia Andrea Ramos is Miss Margaret Ann Bayo. Binibini Pilipinas International 2004 and semifinalist in the Miss International 2004 and attorney Paul Santos, president of Picture City International. All right, the next one. Now, the next lady who will romp away with 20,000 pesos worth of wardrobe from Cumbia at Gateway Mall is our candidate who scored the highest points for beauty of figure. And I am referring, of course, to the winner of the best in swimsuit. Okay. And here is the result. Here she is, our best in swimsuit. Candidate number... Once again, 17, Lia Andrea Ramos. Presenting the award to the best in swimsuit, Lia Andrea Ramos is Miss Carla Bautista, Binibini Pilipinas 2004, and top five in the beach beauty during Miss World 2004. And Mr. Manny Atacador, Chief Operating Officer of Uniprom Incorporated, Araneta Group of Companies, and member of the Bini Bini Filipinas Charities Incorporated Executive Committee. Congratulations to our winners. Don't go away. We'll be right back. Candidate number 17, Lia Andrea Ramos. First special award is for Miss Beautiful Hair to be given by Mane and Tail. The winner will win six months supply of Mane and Tail shampoo and conditioner plus 10,000 pesos in cash. And the award for Miss Beautiful Hair by Mane and Tail goes to candidate number... Mr. Auditor, Mr. Montes. Miss Beautiful Hair, Main and Tail is candidate number 17, Lia Andrea Ramos. Presenting the award to Lia Andrea Ramos, Miss Beautiful Hair by Main and Tail, are Mr. Wilson Tiang, Chairman of the Board, Federated Distributors Incorporated, and Mr. Erwin Tiang, Vice President of Federated Distributors Incorporated. Our next special award is for Miss Philippine Airlines. Now, this is given by Philippine Airlines 
for the candidate who best reflects the sunshine beauty and prestige of our country's flag carrier. Now, Miss Philippine Airlines wins a round-trip ticket for two to any international point of Philippine Airlines destination. And our winner, Miss Philippine Airlines 2006 is... Once again, number 17, Miss Leah Andrea Ramos. Presenting the award to Miss Philippine Airlines. Leah Andrea Ramos is Miss Maria Barbara Aragon, Assistant Vice President for Products, and Mr. Pocholo Azucena, Manager, GSA Relations and Charter Services. Now the next candidate, who, candidate number 17, Leah Andrea Ramos. Please join them, candidate number 18, Mary Pilar de Gorostos. Our next set of finalists to answer questions from our judges. Now, ladies, I know you're familiar with how this goes, so uh, let's continue with you, candidate number 17, Leah Andrea Ramos. His Excellency Ambassador Gregoire Vardakis. Good evening, Leah. Good evening, sir. Aside from the Philippines, which other country would you prefer to spend your life in and why? Thank you for the question. I would definitely say France. I'm a self-confessed Francophile, and I'm very much fascinated with our culture, with the language. And I, I would dream to live in that place and uh, celebrate democracy and, uh, and brotherhood. And as they say in France, c'est la vie. Thank you. Thank you, Leah. Next, let's call on candidate number 18, Mary Pilar Gorostiza. Ladies, now please move to your places of honor on stage as I announce the names of our three new beauty queens. They will also be named Goodwill Ambassadors of Tourism by Secretary Ace Durano of the Department of Tourism, represented here tonight by Assistant Secretary Cynthia Carrion. Okay, we will announce them one after the other. And then I would like the ladies to walk towards their designated posts together. All right, here you are, the three lucky ladies. Pilipining Pilipinas International. Candidate number nine, Denise Lou Valmonte. Pilipining Pilipinas World is candidate number 20, Ana Maris Igpit. And 2006 Pilipining Pilipinas Universe is candidate number 17, Leah Andrea Ramos. Together with Undersecretary Cinta Carrion and Dennis Trillo, presenting the award to Daniel Lou Valmonte, Miss International, Precious Lara Kigaman. Presenting the award to Leah Andrea Ramos is last year's winner of Binibini Filipinas Universe, Giona Cabrera. And presenting the award to Ana Maris Igpit is Binibini Filipinas World 2005, Carlene Aguilar.
it, ladies and gentlemen. Behold our three lovely winners of Filipini Filipinas 2006. We wish all of them the best of luck as they represent our country in their respective international beauty pageants. See you all next year for a grander and more spectacular Filipini Filipinas beauty pageant. What a truly wonderful evening. Our gratitude goes to all 24 candidates for putting up such superb competition. You all made this pageant very memorable for all of us. And to our three lovely winners, my heartfelt congratulations. You really deserve the crown. To all the former beauty queens who came here to give their support to the candidates, thank you very much. Ladies and gentlemen, it was great being with you here tonight. Let us all share the winner's success as we end this very wonderful evening from the Araneta Coliseum. Good night, everyone. Itago ang saya ng tatlong nagwagi sa Binibining Pilipinas 2006 at kahit di pa rin makapaniwala sa kanilang tagumpay, lubos-lubos ang pasasalamat ng mga bagong beauty type list. May flash report si Aubrey Carampel. Malaking pagbabago raw sa kanilang buhay ang inaasahan ng mga bagong beauty queen na nanalo sa nakaraang coronation night ng Binibining Pilipinas. Ang tatlo ang kakatawan sa ating bansa sa mga international beauty pageant. Ngayon pa lang. Ramdam na ni Binibining Pilipinas International Denil Balmonte ang pressure. Maiuwi kaya niya muli ang Miss International title gaya ni Precious Lara Kigaman? I will try my very, very best to also bring home the glory soon. Wala pang nananalong Pilipinas sa Miss World Beauty Pageant. Kaya naman malaking hamon para kay Anna Maris Igpit na maiuwi ang Miss World Crown. Ang pagkakapanalo raw niya bilang Binibining Pilipinas World ay hindi niya inasahan. Very grateful that um, of all the other 24 ladies, I've won a crown and I'm so proud and honored, of course. Si Leah Andrea Ramos naman ang tinanghal na most awarded candidate. Di lang niya inuwi ang corona ng Binibining Pilipinas Universe, siya rin ang napiling Miss Photogenic, Best in Swimsuit, Miss Philippine Airlines, at Miss Main and Tail para sa kanyang magandang buho. I didn't expect to garner as much awards as I did tonight. And I think I was very lucky. This was actually my night.
Yan ang flash report. Pobre Karampel, nag-uulat. Pinilala na po nung Sabado ang mga bagong title holder ng Binibining Pilipinas. At tila nasa cloud nine pa rin ang mga bagong beauty queens. Sino sila? Alamin sa chika ni Aubrey Karampel. Dalawang put apat na binibini ang nagtagisa ng ganda, talento at talino sa ginanap na coronation night ng binibining and Pilipinas 2006. Ang host ng programa, ang ating mga kapusong sina Dingdong Dantes, Dennis Trillo at Pia Guanyo. Umpisa pa lang, humakot na ng awards ang nag-iisang kandidat ng mula sa Davao na si Lia Andrea Ramos. Apat na special awards ang kanyang nakuha. Miss Beautiful Hair, Mane and Tail, Miss Philippine Airlines, Miss Photogenic, at Best in Swimsuit. Siya rin ang nakakuha ng titulong binibining Pilipinas Universe. I didn't expect to garner as much awards as I did tonight. And I think I was very lucky. This was actually my night, I guess. Ang Best in Long Gown naman ay napanaruna ni Anna Marie Stigpit. Siya rin ang kinronahang binibining Pilipinas World. Very grateful that um, of all the other 24 ladies, I've won a crown and I'm so proud and honored, of course. Malaking challenge para kay Ana ang maiuwi ang Miss World Crown dahil wala pang nananalong Pilipinas sa nasabing pageant. Si Daniel Valmonte naman ang itinanghal bilang binibining Pilipinas International. Ngayon pa lang, ramdam na niya ang pressure dahil sa pagkakapanalo ni Precious Lara Kigaman sa Miss International Beauty Pageant noong 2005. Siya na kaya ang susunod na Miss International? I will try my very, very best to also bring home the glory soon. Ngayong napili na ang mga binibining kakatawan sa Pilipinas sa mga international beauty pageant, sino kaya sa kanila ang mag-uwi ng corona at magbibigay karangalan sa ating bansa? Obi Karampel, Nakatutok, 24 Oras.